So I'm just here doing a little repair work, but I thought I could do a review of my check mess kit. And a can of Calacuco. Uh, this is from my order to uh, Barstalica. I hope, I hope I'm pronouncing that all right. If I'm not, uh, my apologies to uh, anybody from Finland out there or anybody whose ears that might be hurting. Uh, but I got a can of uh, fishcock, uh, loosely translated, translated Calacuco. But um, I'm, in, I'm assured by the label that there is in fact no cock in this can. Hard to see, but I think we caught that the catch, so. All right, so the, uh, the check mess kit, it's got a small frying pan slash plate, a big pot, and then a medium sized pot, and it nests nice and neatly as such. And the plate also will act as a double boiler. But today, I'm just using the medium pot and I might use the plate. So I'm just opening up the Calacuco a bit, breaking the seal. And take the paper out and then what we're gonna do is we're just gonna fill that up with water so we kind of get a double boiler effect and let's get her on the fire so we got that going um, oh there's a little bit of water on that I kind of like that off one of the main ingredients in my understanding Calacuco is smoked salmon in a rye bread uh, that sounds actually very appetizing. It might actually also be uh, salmon in rye bread with uh, smoked pork. So I'm not quite sure, but we'll see what this one is. And I think it might be a fun project to try to make some of this in a Dutch oven. So, All right, to uh, speed this up and uh, not lose any heat, what I've done is just use the big cover over top of the small pot. And there's the label of the Calacuco or fishcock and again probably doesn't contain any cock. I've got my uh, shelter all straightened away here or partially straightened away so let's pull that out some nice hot steamy water we did have a bit of a spill so I have to refill it but she warmed up real nice she's not hot to the touch but she's nice and warm we're gonna pull that back oh there's some moisture Oh, there's definitely a smell of pork fat to that. So I'm thinking that there must be a bacon or a ham kind of thing in there. Um, a little bit of water might have got in that. Let's uh, pop that out. I'm going to have to use a knife to uh, so get that out. Like. Um, it's almost like a biscuit. So, we'll just take the uh, Mora knife here. And gonna see if we can pry it out I guess well, that probably worked oh she's breaking apart so oh there's some of the salmon in the uh mm. oh it smells really good mm. well it's definitely easier to call this calacuco and eat it and enjoy it by cock or fish cock mm. All right, let's see if I can get a piece of this on there and so we can see what it looks like. Eat a small chunk of that out of the oh, my MRE ration. We'll just get a little mix of that into the bowl. All right. So basically what I'm getting is kind of like a salmon loaf. Mm. So to me it tastes like salmon, uh, bacon, fat, and uh, rye bread. And the rye bread's pretty mild. kind of a nice little combination all right let's see if we can get this loaf out and upside down on the 
on the plate. There we go. All right, there we got this whole can out. Good sized can too, so if you had that as a survival food, then you have a little tin to boil off water or cook. So we'll just clear that off with the spoon. All right, I'm take the Mora knife and put a little cut. Oh, we got that cut, now we're gonna see a cross section of fish cock. Mm. You know what, I highly suggest getting a couple cans of this if you're going to put a uh, order in to Barcelona, is it Barcelona? Ah, Barcelona. So I uh, highly recommend that if you're going to get a order to Barcelona, um, get a couple cans, put a tin in your car. It looks like it's temperature sensitive because there's not a lot of moisture in there. And good survival food. Pardon me for eating with my mouth, or talking with my mouth full. Hmm. And here's another angle. All right, so both items get a real high mark on uh, a high passing mark. Uh, the Czechoslovakian mess kit is a great little setup. Hmm. Anyway, I am just going to continue to uh, slice off and eat this because it is darn tasty. Hmm. Oh, and there's a nice line there where you can see the the salmon uh, where it uh, divides from the uh, rye bread. <laughs> 